Hey guys. All right, so is that time again? All right, so I didn't actually do a video yesterday, um, mainly because I didn't really have too many. Um, sorry, I'm moving stuff away from my microphone. Um, I didn't really have too much mail yesterday, so I have a little bit extra today. All this stuff that I'm doing right next to the microphone. My gosh, it probably makes sounds like a nightmare. All right, anyway, so let's see, what do we have? Yeah, we have like, oh wow, we have a lot, okay. All right, so my super lavanoid. Okay, there's a little bit of a funny story here. Um, the other night, super lavanoid came on as Azrael, the god of hyperdeath. So it was like, we get a lot of kid Azraels around here, but we usually don't really have one that's god of hyperdeath. I don't know why. I personally think that he's pretty cool. So he comes on as that character, and I tried to say hi Azrael, and I made a typo, and I wrote hi Azruek. <laughs> so it's like A S R U E K. And oh my gosh, people would not let me live it down. So we actually created a whole new AU called Typo Tail, <laughs> where each character's name was completely botched. So anyway, um, so whenever I see the name Super Lavanoid, I feel so bad because all I can think of is my stupid typo. Anyway. And it's a cute little facey face. I don't know what that face is. Is it like a, a laughing smile? Sorry, I'm an idiot when it comes to faces like that. Anyway, thank you for the face. <laughs> fan by Polar Bear Brother. I'm a big fan. Sorry, I'm a very big fan. Gives a fan. Big fan! <laughs> I love it. How, f how big is this fan, though? I mean, where, where am I going to put it? Thank you for the fan. <laughs> Blazy Pants by Blaze Toriel 177. Hey Light, you're totally awesome. Just one question. What's your favorite ship? Good day, Blazy. Um, I think she's asking that because uh, it was mentioned that I'm not a huge fan of Soriel, which is um Toriel and Sans. I just I don't know, I just don't like that one. It just doesn't sit right with me. Uh anyway, um she's my favorite ship. Is this only Undertale, or is this also with AUs? Because, I don't know. Well, alright, I'll just stick with Undertale. Um. Uh, it's like one of those choices in Undertale, you just don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I have I have a few favorites. I, mean, I really like Papiton, um, Papyrus and Metaton. Um, but I also like... Um, no, people have some some issues with this one, and let me just you know hear me out. Let's just say that Frisk isn't as young as people think she is. I, I have a theory about that. People keep saying that she's young, she's a kid, she's this, these, that, she's that. But I don't know. I don't know if it was actually confirmed anywhere that she's a kid. And if you look at the opening credits where it shows the monsters fighting the humans, the humans are incredibly short compared to the monsters. And so, in my opinion, like, when you actually see it in-game, now the monsters look a lot smaller, but so does Frisk. So it kind of looks like Frisk could be an adult, or maybe even a teenager, you know, that's still, like, growing, but almost fully grown? I know that sounds stupid, but... So I have a theory that she isn't even as young as people think she is. But, let's just say it's in the future, it's after Undertale has happened, and she's not a kid anymore. I ship Frisk and Sans. Yes, the ship is really weird if they're talking about her as when she's in the underground, because that's just, like, gross and weird. But if we're talking about, like, the aftermath, I think Frisk and Sans is really cute. So that's my thing. But um, when it comes to AUs, I don't know. I don't know, really. I mean, it would obviously be Lost Sans, but it could literally be anyone, so... I don't know, I hope that helps. And I guess Soriel isn't that bad. It's just, I have to make jokes about it. it. It's just, I don't know, it just doesn't seem right to me. I'd like, if it comes to Toriel, I would like to see her and Asgore get back together. I'm just saying. If Toby Fox ever makes another game that's similar to Undertale or sort of a continuation of the story, I'm not gonna say Undertale 2 was something similar. I would like to make it, like, I would like to see it be made that Toriel and Asgore do get back together, because I think that should happen. I don't think it should be Sans and Toriel. I think they, I think Asgore and Toriel should get back together. 
Oh, oh there. So that's that. People ask me a question and I give like a huge answer and it's probably not even necessary. Blowy's Life by Emerald X. Oh god, am I gonna have to do more voices? I don't want to do more voices. Oh, okay, not really. Howdy, I'm fly- <laughs> I can't talk. I can't even read. Oh, mornings, why do you have to do this to me? Okay. Howdy, I'm- Flower. Flower the flowy. God, I messed up. I'll try again. Don't leave. Howdy, I'm fl- Flodly. <laughs> Flodly the flower. Messed up again. I'll try one more time. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Ugh, I finally got it. This was Flowey saying this. Flowey the flower. Are you sure it isn't Flowdy the flower? Loudly? Loudly, that's what it was. Loudly. <laughs> Gaster's Life by Emerald X. Uh, it's just a bunch of... Blah, 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 blah. It's Gaster, but he forgot how to talk. Well, even when he does, I can't read what he says either because I'm not good at wingdings. Somebody told me I've got wingdings all wrong. All this time I was like typing like... I was trying to do like a translation sort of. It was like A, B, C, D, all in wingdings. And then I said, I can never seem to find the symbols that everybody talks about, specifically the hands or this and that. And people are like, oh, you have to write it in caps. Seriously? I did all that. Like, I went through wingdings one, two, three, because now there's a whole bunch of different ones. And it turns out all I had to do was write it in caps. Wow. I'm smart. Frisk is Dora by It's Frisk. Oh my god. Hey, Light, I have a question for you. How do I get resident? I mean, I don't want to be like those people that ask for resident, but it's very important. Oh, and also, this house is amazing. I don't know how you did almost the full Undertale map in 51 by 51 or 41 by 41. I don't know, but it's something amazing. And the most important thing is SANS! <laughs> That's from Underpants, in case you guys don't know. If you don't know what that is, go look it up. It's funny. Um, ahem. Sorry, I had to do it. Uh, or I said, I had, she said, I had to. Ugh, I can't. Have a nice day or night, or I don't know. Hey, you're using my line. <laughs> Oop. I'm a boy, okay? Oh, okay, sorry, I called you a girl. Sorry, sorry. But, uh, he, he said, sorry, I had to. Don't you think I'm a girl? <laughs> it's okay, if it makes you feel any better. People think I'm a boy, so hey. I don't really care, though. It doesn't bother me that people think that. It doesn't, I don't care. You think whatever you want, because I really am, like, I'm, I might have, I'm, okay, I'm not gonna go there. I might be a girl. I might be a mom. But I'm technically one of the boys. I mean, come on now. I always have been, always will be. I don't care. Uh, let's see. Okay, so about the plot, it's 51 by 51. It's the largest I can possibly have it. Um, I... And it's... <laughs> uh, almost the entire Undertale map, is that what he said? Uh, I don't know, how did you, how did you do that almost? Okay, yeah. Um... A lot of, like tweaking and stuff like that because okay originally it just started off as like you would fall down and there was a house and then there was a way to get back up to Snowden that was pretty much it and I said well don't worry at some point I'll do waterfall and one night I decided to do waterfall and then I made the uh, the exit to Snowden a little bit bigger so it sort of looked like you're walking through Snowden forest then I expanded to 41 by 41 and then I you know I did some more then I expanded to 51 by 51, and I didn't really change much underground because I was too busy building, you know, like Judgment Hall and all that stuff. Well, finally, one day I decided I was going to change everything. So now it's like you fall down, there's the ruins, and I've changed it even more now. I'm actually going to walk through after I'm done here so you can see what I've done to change it. Um, you know, so now there's like, there's the ruins, there's Snowden forest then you come up to the surface technically surface it's uh, snowed in town which is where we all like to hang out then there's waterfall oh my gosh excuse me i'm a pig anyway um there's waterfall then hotland which i didn't have before including the lab i've added the true lab which because uh, <clears throat> that was like highly requested um i've added a little bit more to waterfall uh including the uh the artifact that the dog absorbs after you play the piano. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go look it up. It's actually really funny. I Now that I when I play it, I don't even bother getting the artifact because I already know what's going to happen, and I don't know the significance of the dog absorbing the artifact, so... Whatever. Um, so, let's see. What else did I do? 
Oh, and then of course, you know, I added a little bit of an MTT resort. It's it's small. There's really not much I can do with it, but um, and then Judgment Hall. I, I made the uh, the entrance to Judgment Hall, but it's all underground. Even though Judgment Hall is up on the surface, so to, so to speak, it's technically supposed to be underground, which is why if you look out the windows, you can't see anything. But when you look out the windows in Judgment Hall, you can't see anything either. You just see that it's light. So that's why there's glowstones instead of an actual window. I hope that helps. Um, I don't know how I did it, really. It's just a lot of patience and some building and time and whatever. So, And it's not definitely not the entire Undertale map. I wish it was, but it's not. Um, but I do have bits and pieces of everything there. So, yeah. Um, and about resident, um, who are you? It's Frisk. Um, you should be resident by now if you, if you aren't already. Um, so hopefully if you get on today and if I see that you're not resident, I will make you resident because you have been on for a while and I, some people apparently slip through the cracks, so I'm sorry about that. Anyway, so I hope that answers both your questions. Uh, let's see. I like how you titled that Friskus Dora, too, by the way. I thought that was funny. Ships by Emerald X. Oh, God. Pyrus X MTT is pop uh, Poppy. Wow, I can't read. Happy Ton. I was just talking about that. Chara X Chocolate? Wait, what? I don't know who that is. Um, Sans X Toriel is... Toriel, yes, we were talking about that. Toriel is Asgore is Asriel? <laughs> Yes, I, apparently it would be, but that's, um, yeah, Azrael is a combination of the two names together. Um, Frisk and Shara's Genocide Frisk. Oh. I, I don't, I don't know. Then Frisk x Azrael is Asgris, Azrisk, wow. Well, at least they didn't, at least she didn't put down, um, uh, ah, what? What is it? Who is it? Frisk X. No, not Frisk. Shara X. Azrael. That one drives me crazy too, because they're like siblings. You can't do that. Hi, my Emerald X. I love this plot. I love to roleplay in it. Yay! Thank you. I'm glad. Papyrus by Minor Master, 2003. Please don't make me have to do the voice. Oh, the Great Papyrus loves your videos. Yeah, okay, that's not actually what it says. It says yeah, yeah, yeah. Eh, Zans. <laughs> uh. Oh, Zanzi. Is that an L or an I? I, L, whatever. By Naruto Rocks. And there's nothing there. Well, all right then. Eee! Like three children, one adult. Okay, it's just a bunch of letters. Yays by Twisted P. I'm Sans now. <laughs> hey, me too. See? Only I'm the girl version of Sans. Girl version of Genocide Sans. Um, I was gonna switch, but I decided not to. I like this skin, actually, so... Oop, I lost my... There we go. Fresh Undyne by Undertale Gamer 33 Ugh. Hello, it's Fresh Undyne. Your roleplay is really awesome, and you are fun to roleplay with. I try to come here every day, but sometimes I can't. You're very awesome. Stay fresh from Fresh Undyne. As long as Fresh Undyne is cooler than, um, Fresh Sands. Uh... Thank you, I'm glad that you enjoy it here, and, um, you don't- you don't have to come here every day, I mean, it's not like- you're not obligated to- hold on, somebody was writing to me. Um, but anyway, yeah, I'm glad that, you know, you enjoy it here. I enjoy having people here. I'm glad that people are happy, yay! Undertale Vids by Judy Hops, 2016. Hi, I watch your vids and I love Undertale. I'm a big fan. As as a big fan. Yes, me too. I'm a big fan of Undertale as well. Thank you for watching my videos. I appreciate it. Backup message by Wisp the Kitty. I was kicked from disconnection, so I don't know if my message made it. Though in case it didn't, I subbed to you, but didn't get to tell you the day before. And also thank you for complimenting my user. Um, 
keep up the awesome housing. Yes, I was talking about how Wisp the Kitty is actually a really cute name. <laughs> Here we go again with the cats going bonkers behind me. Uh, Smiley Face by Sapphire YT, YouTube. Just wanted to say you're a great person. Aw, thanks. I try to be. I do have my moments where I'm like, ugh, but most of the time I try to be nice. Um, meme by Juicebox333. Oh, that kind of makes me, like, want a juice box now. Meme. Uh, okay. Meme. You know, there are some people out there that call those memes. It drives me crazy when they say that. I'm like, it's meme! It's meme! One more thing by Emerald X. Did you get my other mail? My housing lagged me out. Yeah, that's been happening a lot lately. Uh, Hypixels being dumb. I don't know why, but... I've been, in the last couple days, it seems like every day there's at least one point in time where I get booted off and it could just be, you know, just for a second, or like the entire place, everyone gets booted off. And then, you know, we all have to come back one by one and we're all scratching our heads going, D -d -d what happened? What happened? So I don't know what's been going on, but trust me, you're not the only one, so it's okay. Hypixel's being stupid. Jokes three. Sorry. <laughs> Don't be sorry. By Sans underscore 59. Alright, here we go. <laughs> I'm tired now. Knock knock. Who's there? Dishes. Dishes who? Dishes a very bad joke. <laughs> nice. I've actually told that one. It's from Undertale. It's actually in the game. Um, it's when you go to the MTT resort with, uh, with Sans. And he's talking about the jokes that he's been telling Toriel behind the door. The whole reason that the whole Toriel thing even exists. Uh, knock knock who's there Theodore Theodore who Theodore was Theodore was locked so I knocked why did the chicken go to the the CN the CN science CN I don't know I'm not sure what that is I'm sorry to get to the other side sorry I was in Snowden and I was chilled to the bone <laughs> nice uh, that time of year is coming up soon I know that's gonna be happening here too. Hi, person. By Felshara. Uh, I can't pronounce that name. Sorry. What is your most embarrassing secret? Well, now, hey, now, if I was to say that, then it wouldn't be a secret anymore, and I'd be incredibly embarrassed every, every time that somebody said, I'm watching your videos right now. No, I'm not, I don't want to say that. I do have a really, really big embarrassing secret, and it's... It, just no. <laughs> Sorry, I can't answer that question. But it's a good one. It's a good question. We Love You by Lija. Oh, I like that name. Provided I pronounced it right. I mean, either way, it's still nice. What is this, the troll police over here? <laughs> Look at this guy. That's awesome. Hi. Ah! I'm up in my face. Best T-Wire ever. I think that's supposed to be thank- Is that thank you? Best thank you ever? I don't know. Make- Make more videos! Make a part today! Turn to the next page. Um, wait, before I turn to the next page, I'll, I'll acknowledge this. The reason I didn't make one yesterday is because I made one so late on Saturday that I was afraid that all of them would have to shift to evenings, so I figured I would just skip a day and then do this one. Um, smiley face. Please have a good day, smiley face. Well, I'm sure I will, although I am quite tired and groggy, but hey, what happens when you wake up at 6.30 in the morning? But you don't go to bed until super late because you're a sh lazy butt. <laughs> Too lazy to go to sleep, but it doesn't make sense. Never mind. Um, this, I don't think this is appropriate. I'm not even gonna try to read it. No, no, not gonna read it. Well, you saw it, so that's the point. I don't know who that kid is, but if he keeps sending messages like that, I may need to, uh, kick him, ban him, whatever. So, hey you, Justin Inc. I am 07. If you keep coming on and writing stuff like that, sorry, but I'm gonna have to kick you, ban you. Up by N64 Gaming. Because the if that means what I think it means. Anyway, so what's up? How you doing? <laughs> I'm doing all right. When did you acquire a New York City accent? Bark by Midnight. That's awesome. With the underscores. Mid. Bark, 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 bark. There's a black paw print. Aw, hey. Annoying dog slash Midnight. Aw. 
So would you be a, a black annoying dog? Because that would be like super cute. Could you like imagine like an inverted annoying dog where he's black with the yellow, or yellow uh, white like smile and eyes and stuff? Oh, that'd be adorable. Some people would find it creepy, but I think it would be really cute. I'm just, I'm a big fan of black dogs anyway. I'm not a huge fan of white ones. I don't know why. They get dirty a lot quicker. <laughs> and is there anything like my dog? They don't like baths. They say the dogs are supposed to like water. My dog doesn't. He hates water. He's like, bath? Screw you! Anyway, um, male of Undertale. Oh, Oh, it's under- Okay, okay, okay. I think we're good now. <sighs> Troll police, could you please get out of my face? Um, I'm not an Undertale character. I would like to be yo yokai, yokai tail. Oh, wait. I am not an Undertale character. I would be if yokai yokai tail existed. I don't know what that is, but that's fine. You don't have to be an Undertale character. It's cool. Um, nobody nobody said that you had to be an Undertale character. Uh, we accept anyone. I mean, hell, I was on here. Ooh, sorry. Heck. I was on here earlier as Purple Girl, you know, not earlier, a couple days ago. It was like a, you know, it's like a gender bent version of Purple Guy from Five Nights at Freddy's. Oh, whatever. <laughs> I mean, it happens. Hi, by 360 for days. <laughs> I love the name. Love your house. Thank you. I'm glad you enjoy it. Ugh, voting commercials. I don't know if you, you probably can't hear the TV behind me, thank God, but. approve this message. Uh, hello, nice build by Temi05. Hoi, Temi! <laughs> there's no, there's nothing. Hello, nice build. Thank you. Appreciate it. I will, I'll read that one in just a second. The new one. SSGBC by Kitty Warrior. I don't know what that stands for. LOL, Heidi. Hi, Heidi. Oh my god, I can't read. <laughs> I can't believe I just said Heidi. What the hell's wrong with me? LOL. How D. Ugh. Hashtag story shift gender bent Shara. <laughs> okay. Hi. <laughs> or howdy. Or Heidi. I mean, hey, you know, whatever floats your boat. Whatever boats your float. Uh, Kwam Kwame Gamer by Kwame Gamer. Well, okay. I love your roleplay. It's the best. Can you help me someday so I can do a roleplay just like you? From Kwame. I really hope I'm saying that right. I'm sorry if I'm not. Um, gamer. Uh, maybe? I, I mean, I can't guarantee. I mean, like I said, mine has been changed so many times. I mean, I can't guarantee that I could make another one like this, you know? But I'd be willing to help you out, or at least even give you advice, even if it means I can't leave here. I have three guests already. Like, I'm not even talking. Boy, by Yuki-chan. I, I really hope I'm pronouncing that right. You haven't corrected me yet, so I guess that's good. Boy, I'm Tem. Tem the Temme. <laughs> ta ta <laughs> Temme! <laughs> oh my god. It reminds me of South Park. Timber. Meet my new friend. Hi, I'm Bob. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Hi, by Hunt16. Hi. Hello. You get a lot of those. Hi. Tem. Again. A Yuki. Buy the Tem Flakes or you have bad Tem. <laughs> the face. The face is so cute. And a bunch of symbols and stuff. Is that supposed to be Gaster? Come on now. Gaster, get your... Act together. I can't read your messages. A shocked face by Yuki. You got the Undertale uh, the, <laughs> the Undertale resource pack too? Yes, yes I do. I love it. It's also linked in one of my other videos. Okay, so I think that was the okay. I think that's the last one when it comes to red messages. Yes. So new messages. This is one was just sent by Naruto Rocks. Again. Question. Hi, want to be friends? Sure, add me. And if you're here right now, I'll add you. So that concludes that. Let me go into my red messages and delete them. Clickety, clickety, click, click, clickety, clack. Okay. And now 
I'm gonna I'll wait for the chat to sort of go down for a second because deleted message, deleted message, deleted message. <laughs> really? I had no idea. Okay, so this is the these are the changes that I've made. Some of them were suggested by other people, some of them were things that were bugging me for a while. So you fall down into the golden bed of flowers, which again with the texture pack all look like flowy. I put a whole bunch of signs here explaining what I'm about to show you. So let's just continue. So there's flowy. Someone suggested that I make this completely dark because technically when you make flowy, it is dark. So that's what I did. But I still have the signs that says howdy I'm flowy, flowy the flower. You keep going. These are supposed to be the ruins. Um, if I was to use stone bricks, it would be purple, so it would be just like the runes. But not everyone has that texture pack, so I figured brick was the best bet. You keep going, it's just a maze, basically. It's nothing major. And then, so I completely changed this a little bit. Um, so you got Toriel's house with the weird-looking tree, and I'm sorry, it looks like a fork. There's nothing I can do about that. It worked with what room I had. Nothing here that's supposed to be sort of the kitchen living area and then this obviously would be in the basement but i can't go underground any further than i already am so there's that this is black wool which is the texture pack it looks like this but it would normally just be all black and then the end of episode of forest is where you get followed by sands <clears throat> this is the bridge that the bars are made too big to get through um this would be the ladder to get up into snowden town but i want to show off the rest of it so this is just snowden forest I didn't do too much with it because I want this to be sort of an open area anyway. Because yesterday I reached a new um, record of the amount of people that I had here. And everyone decided to come and congregate here to become, uh... Hi, pro police again. People wanted to be, um... Uh, uh, I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh, um... Hi. People wanted to just sort of hang out here and whatever. So I, I pretty much left it empty so people can still hang out here. We can talk and chill. It's become sort of like a little party area, I guess. But I did put the Sentry Station, the frozen spaghetti, the nice cream, and a couple of bridges over ice. And then down here we've got Waterfall. I no longer have the ladder to get there. It's like Waterfall. Waterfall hasn't changed much. I mean, it has because I added the true lab. The waterfall is a little different over here. Really, the only thing that changed was Undyne's house. It just changed the, where it was, and there's no sentry station here anymore. Other than that, everything's the same in this area. I added the door that you can find Gaster in. This is the other part of waterfall. I put Lapis Lazuli, Lazuli down um, because there are parts of waterfall that don't have the tall grass. The sentry station is in here now. And here is the artifact that can be absorbed. Note, it's actually ham. See? Everybody loves ham. Put Gerson's, Ger, Ger, Gerson's, Gerson's shop there. Now you walk through Waterfall. I'm oh, sorry, Hotland. And we've got the True Lab. Again, this is by request. So we've got all the refrigerators and stuff. One of them, you know, shakes. This is going to be where the DT extractor is, but I don't I don't know how to make one yet, so it's just sitting there. And this is the bedroom, so it's got all the beds and stuff. And this person is following me around. So there really isn't too much to the true lab, but there isn't much to the true lab to begin with, so whatever. This lab, I don't know if anything changed since then. Um the resort. 3C burger pants. This used to have a fountain, by the way, it doesn't anymore. Is there just the resort thing? Hold on. Sorry, I'm doing a video and just showing this off. I'm not ignoring you, I promise. I mean, maybe kind of, I guess I kind of am ignoring you. I don't mean to. Anyway, everything's still the same here, except for the fact that now I don't have the fencing to block off the lava, so people can set themselves on fire if they really want to. But like, it, it didn't look very good. And then nothing here has changed. It's still Judgment Hall. I mean, it, it just still leads to Judgment Hall, so it's not really a huge deal. <clears throat> Getting a phone call, I just don't feel like answering it. Um...
there is something up on uh, up in the like snowed in town that I made. Not great, but it's something. This goes all the way to the end of the property now. It's not where it used to be, so it's like this is the very end. Mainly because I wanted it hidden from the rest of it. Do you know those tunnels? Like it looks like an igloo, but you go into it and you end up on the other side of the town. I made that. Not very good, but I made it. But this is just, I mean, you just walk through it. It's not like, I don't know. It's not like you can just go in and teleport to the other side. Although that would be really cool if you could. And then that brings you out by Judgment Hall. So, yeah, that's that. Other than that, nothing has really changed. I just sort of changed the AFK rooms a little bit and moved them over. But that's it, really. And I can't think of any other changes that need to be made, so... Um, yeah, I guess I'm gonna go for now. I just wanted to show that off, so... Thank you for watching. Have a good day, night, whatever it is where you are. And I will be back most likely tomorrow with a whole bunch of more messages. Bye-bye!